Marcus, in what ways do you feel like this, this first team offense progressed today? I thought we were efficient. Um, you know, made some plays, got some points on the board. We can always be better, though. And I think that's what's great about preseason is it allows you to get into these real game situations and find where you can improve it. When it comes to, you know, the overall week and the, the work week, you know, two joint practices and then in, in this preseason game, in what ways do you feel like this whole entire week kind of felt in terms of, like, the competition between these two organizations? Yeah, it was great. I think – especially during this time of the training camp, it's great to get different looks, um, go against a defense that maybe you're not seeing every single week. And um, I think f all in all, I thought for both sides, it was just great work. And I think, um, you know, looking back on it, it's going to help us for the season. You take me through that touchdown to Z. It seems like you had a great alley, great window of throw on the slant back in your end zone. Yeah, I think it just started up front. The guys did a great job of giving me some time. Um, and OZ, and, you know, he's always at the right place at the right time. And when you're able to do that, you can trust where you can put the ball. And um, he came down with it, executed the play well. We only got one more game left before things count. But really, you like the way the offense is making progress. Just a finite amount of time left before things count. Yeah, absolutely. You know, there's there's things that we definitely have to clean up on. Um, you know, red zone penalties for sure. Um, but at the same time, though, I, I think all in all, through this entire kind of training camp, uh, I like where we're going and I like where we're headed. Had a couple of, no, had a couple of explosive plays with the tight ends a little bit. Can Kind of walk me through the, the Kyle Pitts play and then also hitting Anthony for like 40 yards. <laughs> I mean, two, two tight end plays that were pretty explosive for you guys. Yeah, again, I think um, our guys did a great job of executing the play, um, had time to, to see the field, and it just kind of happens. I think when you have guys that are explosive like Kyle and, and Ferk, um, they're going to find ways to get open. And uh, with the time that we had uh, in the pocket, it just really allowed those guys to get down the field. Um, you know, I, I think just at the end of it, the last drive, being able to complete some of those passes, get, get a first down, um, you know, and continue to get the momentum going. Um, you know, it's great that we got points early on. And um, I think as we progress as an offense, just continue to have the gas pedal down and, um, you know, just finding ways to, to continue to score, continue to just kind of onslaught. And um, you know, as we go forward, we'll, we'll learn from it. Um, you know, those couple things, you know, they leave a bad taste in your mouth a little bit. But all in all, I thought it was a good day. Um, from what I can gather, the Jets have had many of their starters in tonight. Jacksonville will be going with ones on ones, looking for a, a competitive that environment, atmosphere. Later in the week. For sure, for sure. And I, I look forward to these joint practices again. Um, you know, when you're competitive in practice, um, it just really makes those game situations a lot more real, a lot more realistic. And, um, you know, it just really helps us prepare for, for the season.